Hello guys, welcome with another video. In this video, we will discuss about Kuang University of Science and Technology, or you can say it's post tech. So you might have seen different information regarding this university in your Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram pages. So let's talk about it's in private university in Pohang, South Korea, and it was founded in December 3rd, 1986. So here is the information. It's in private professor university in Pohang. So let's talk about how to go in official website. You have to just click on this and open a new tab. Before going this, I might here mention that the rank of this university is sixth in South Korea. So let's go into official website. From here, you can see different information like about post track admin and academics for research campus, new center and faculty application. If you will go down, you can see different information of this university. So from here, you can see either you are going to see in Korean or in English language. If you are going to in Korean language, then you might have the extension of English means from Korean to English automatically in your Chrome or which browser you are using. So let's go into undergraduate. Here we can see different information like the division of humanities and social science. If you click here, you will go automatically the official page of this subject and undergraduate studies, mathematics, physics, chemistry, life science. From here, you can see email of that particular department. If you are facing any difficulty or you want to know any information, you just have to send an email to that concerned your department and they will reply you within two to three days. I have been experience of this and material science and engineering. You can see its location means the building that is the location of that particular department in post university and telephone number. If you are going to call them, you have to dial this number. Obviously, every faculty has its own number. From here, you can see 721, it's 715 here and mechanical engineering, industrial and management engineering, electrical engineering, computer science and engineering, chemical engineering, convergence IT engineering. So let's go into with another tab that is the electrical engineering we will discuss about faculty. So from here, you can see different information like organization means the research of that particular your professor. From here, you can see the Professor Lee's research direction is nano device. Another back professor, its direction is technology enable of enhancement MOS structure and communication information, smart display, intelligent semiconductor, nano bio, MADS, wireless communication, CAD, analog IC, and Kim Lab and control theory, intelligent radar, intelligent control, WAD, energy system, and physical electrical lab, electric energy, and circuit, and exploratory electronic system lab, and quantum computer and quantum networks. So you are just have to click like here, the page of that particular professor if you want to get more information or you have to just send an email to your professor in the email you have to copy your email in your gmail or yahoo account and in the subject you have to write request for kgsp gks acceptance letter and you have to write a short email in the end you have to attach your cv and transcript both in one file that will be much appreciated because if you attach these both files that will go directly into inbox if you let a different files like number of files more than three or four that will go into a spam of that professor's email and professor usually don't have a time means schedule of their time is not free so they don't see spam or any other folder rather than only in inbox so from here, you can see the information of this uh, professor. You can also search the people like 
I myself just go through these back is the students is there any international student or uh, for me here you can see the botharji and its administration undergraduate students and like if you're from any country and you see your people you will just send them an email like this copy this and send an email to your country mate he will better guide you so let's go into another tab that is scholarship so from here you can see undergraduate and graduate scholarship information so let's go into detail so from here you can see important period notice on gks 2022 so there are different tabs let's go into another that is the financial aid what is financial aid you can see general regulation fellowship and internal or external fellowship you can see that is our main target gks scholarship and funded by nied eligibility applicants who meet the nid eligibility and post english proficiency level please check the admission guide you have to just download the application guide and just go through all details airfare language course for one year like they will give you an extra classes for this particular tuition fees awarded for excellent korean language proficiency research support printing cost completing grant and you can see useful website from here you can see different link or a scholarship and settlement allowance and this is the citizenship for masters and phd is regular ta or r scholarship you can say research assistant or teaching assistant program per month you can see tuition fee living allowances and in total so here was all for this let's go into another tab that is the information of gks you can see here the brief information of this of 2022 dear prospective candidate for 2022 graduate program starting 2022 gks program nid will only accept uh, appropriated or confirmed documents for part of application so this is notice is provided uh, to the students requirement and the fulfill set guidance of 2022 will be released in tab 2022 or now please refer to 2022 one details so you can see the details of 2021 and you have to arrange all your documents according to that because most be the documents would be the same so let's go into official this korea website because i you did see this study in korea you have to so this i will also send the link of this in description so you can see different information like number of students international students in doctor program there are 54 and master 18 combined means for master and doctor both are combined program there are 18 you can see 19 90 students and number of students and professors here are the del so let's go into another detail that is the possible language course you can see scholarship support 100% ms and uh, this is the monthly stipend and qualification and department in charge office number and number of scholarship you can see sent settlement allowance for international student you can see in usd dollars here is the qualification and department for ra and ta you can see its monthly stipend and different details as well so dormitory support they also provide you dormitory and except this these are the different information of this post registry so this was all for my side if you are facing any difficulty you can ask just keep in mind you have to send more and more emails to your department there are two as per my experience first you have to send an email to particular your research direction if you are not getting any response you have to send emails to your just particular department like i have interest in power side first of all i will focus on power 
processor. If I am not getting any response from that power subject processor, then I will send each and every processor because I have to get an acceptance letter for getting the high chance of my application. So this is for my side. If you have any query, you can just send your query in comment section.